Hey guys, what's going on? I'm back with another quick DVD update. Had some pickups over the last week or so. A few DVDs, a couple of Blu-rays. Just gonna show them to you guys real quick. First up, the Stendhal Syndrome. This is a Truma DVD. It is a Dario Argento film starring his daughter, Asia Argento. The director's cut of the movie, which I have never seen. Uh, looks pretty interesting. I have read some good reviews about it online, so uh, definitely interested in checking it out. As I said, it is a Troma DVD, so had I owned this back when I did my Troma update, I could have included this in that video. But if you guys have seen this, if you guys are fans, not fans, let me know what you think of it. Let me know uh, what to expect from it. Also picked up Five Across the Eyes. This is an Anchor Bay release. Uh, I have not really read too much about this movie. I uh, basically picked it up because of what I read on the cover itself. So, you know, they say not to judge a book by its cover, but guess what? It's not a book. It's a DVD. So, it sounded pretty good to me. Uh, you know, the, the short little reviews on there made it sound pretty interesting. I'm um, definitely interested in checking this out. Same thing, if you guys have seen this, let me know what you think of it. Uh, if you don't like it, you know, tell me why. Also picked up a few Blu-rays. Got Hatchet on Blu-ray. I love this movie. I have it on DVD. I actually have the, uh, the Circuit City exclusive DVD, which came with the R-rated version as well as the unrated version. Um, this is the unrated director's cut on Blu-ray. Uh, definitely can't wait to watch it in blue. Love, love, love this movie. I think it's a great slasher film. And also got The Mist on Blu-ray as well. This is one of my favorite Blu-ray covers. I really like this. I really wish they had included this on the DVD at the time when I had not owned a Blu-ray player, but you know it's not an issue anymore now that I do have a Blu-ray player. Uh, this is the two-disc collector's edition, Stephen King's The Mist, directed by Frank Darabont. It includes the black and white version as well as the theatrical version in color. I'm definitely interested in watching the black and white version. I know that's what Frank Darabont had originally intended to do with the film, so it'll definitely be interesting to check that out. This is a really, really, really great Stephen King film. If you guys haven't checked this out, you definitely should. I highly recommend it. Incredible, incredible ending. And then finally, uh, got this in the mail today. You guys might be thinking, I thought you already got this in the mail. Well, I did, and I attempted to watch it this weekend, as I said I would. And, of course, the uh, DVD had some glitches in it, which absolutely drove me insane, because, as I mentioned in my past video, I had wanted to see this movie for so long. I was so excited to finally watch it. I laid down the little guy, my son, we're going to watch it. You know, I got through the first scene, I think, on the second scene, and started to uh, freeze and skip and jump around. So, took the disc out, looked at it, not a scratch on it, not a mark on it. I had purchased this brand new. Um, popped it in again to see what was going on. Same exact thing. So apparently it was just some sort of defect in the disc. So I sent it away for another one. And uh, here it is. It arrived today. So hopefully now I'll be able to watch it this weekend with no issues. Um, definitely made me pretty mad though. Like I said, I was really, really looking forward to watching it. I was all ready, you know. I'm laying down. I had my snacks all ready to go. <laughs> And of course, like I said, not even five minutes into the film, it started skipping and freezing. So, the joy of DVDs. But uh, hopefully this one works better. Hopefully this one's uh, top quality. And uh, as I said, once I do watch it, I will let you know what I think about it. Uh, Ms. Paul, I'll let you know if I'm singing the song in my head. Because uh, I wish I could have been this weekend. I really, really do. But, that's it for now, guys. Um, as I said, I know it was a short video. just wanted to uh, update you guys. I usually update videos, you know, every few days or so. It's been, you know, five or six days since I've added something, so just want to let you guys know I'm still around. Uh, I'll be back with some more videos shortly, some more rare DVD videos, some cool edition videos, uh, maybe some reviews. I've watched a few other films over the weekend since I couldn't watch this. I'll let you know what I think of them. But uh, give me some comments, subscribe. You know, as I always say, I appreciate every single one of them. Thanks a lot, guys.